Okay, so if you have an ASUS Prime B550 Plus AC HES motherboard, and obviously in this case we're missing the wireless driver. This is after doing all the updates, um, doing all the updates with Windows Update on Windows 10. Basically, you'll just obviously Google okay your motherboard model. And then we'll go to the website, make sure it's from ASUS, not some other random place. In here, we can go to support. Okay, so once you go to support, um, we'll accept the cookies. Here you can see driver and utility. Go to there, pick your operating system. This is Windows 10. And then in here, we have wireless. Just download that. Um, I just save it to my desktop. You'll probably end up saving it to your downloads. And if you want, you can do all the chipset and other stuff, um, but usually Windows Update's pretty good with that. Uh, the chipset one sometimes is the one that's less commonly installed properly with the update, so if you want, um, I would do maybe do that one. But usually it's okay as long as it's not showing the triangle. All right, we got uh, 7-zip here, so we right-click and then we do 7-zip and extract to this folder. Um, but if you have like the Windows thing, so let's say you have Windows Explorer, if you open here, or there'll be like an extract option here, but you can open with Windows Explorer, and then you can just drag all this stuff out onto the desktop or in a folder. But uh, since I have 7-zip, I'm going to go to 7-zip, and we're going to extract to this folder. Same thing with the chipset one. Okay, 7-zip, and extract to the folder, and close. All right, there's some stuff that it didn't like, but uh, we'll close that. And then you just open those folders instead of the zipped files. And you just run the either ASUS setup or the regular setup. Either one should work. And once this finishes, let's open the device manager here again. You should see, oops, uh, device manager. And here you can see the driver is no longer missing. And if you go into here, you can see now we have access to the wireless. So that's pretty much it. Then we got the... Um, driver chipset thing, we can open that, and same thing, ASUS setup, or you can do the chipset driver, either one, let's do the ASUS setup, and we'll let it install any other drivers here, you can go to device manager if you want to see if anything changes, usually this thing will refresh itself as it installs new drivers, here you can see it's starting up the chipset software installer, okay, I don't know why it's giving these. I'm gonna go in here and turn off all notifications from suggested. Get rid of that junk. And here you go. Okay, so you have all of these. AMD processor pow um, power management support, AMD GPIO driver, AMD PSP driver, AMD SM bus. You can just leave all of these. Um, I don't know what this for promon promontory, what's that? <laughs> Anyways, we'll just install all of them. I didn't see any junk like antiviruses or stuff. Sometimes they try and sneak in some junk software like that. But uh, yeah, and then we should see this. There you go. You see it's refreshing. And the reason it's doing that is because it's getting new drivers. If you had the things expanded, you would actually see different drivers like appearing or disappearing. But uh, there you go. And we'll just let it install all itself. And then we just restart the computer and we should be good to go. All right. So usually I like to get the manufacturer's um, chipset drivers because Windows Update sometimes doesn't have the proper ones. And yep, we got to restart. But that's pretty much it. Hopefully this video helped you guys out. If it did, like, comment, subscribe, share my channel with others so that they can learn how to upgrade and repair their devices as well. And if it helped you save a bunch of money, please consider contributing a little to the channel. Every little bit helps and allows me to continue making these videos for a living. If you can't help out that way, watch a few of my other videos, like and comment on them as well because that's what the algorithm likes to see. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.